camaraderie of the coaching staff. What have you learned as far as adding people to the staff over the years as you've grown? Oh, I, I think that um, just um, taking your time, number one, to select the right people, having really set criteria of what you're looking for and what you need, and, and then making sure they really, really want to be here at BYU for all the right reasons. And I think when that happens, um, it's pretty a, a very seamless transition and it generates momentum for your staff. Do you think you made mistakes in hiring? No, I don't. I, I think we chose exactly what we needed all the way along and for every time period and I think the record and the wins reflect that. So uh, I think it's been, and I'm appreciative for all the coaches that have been here and all, and we won a lot of games and it wasn't just because I was the head coach. Are you a better administrator now? Than, than Learning. Before? I think making progress. But How do you? How do you think the, the run play action emphasis looked uh, on both sides of the ball today? Today it was much better from an offensive perspective. Prior, um, it had been basically if the offense was going to move the ball, it had to be through the air through mm -hmm. play action. Today, uh, they were able to run it a little bit better, which was ena enabled them to throw it a little bit better. So I, I think the offense had a nice day today, just overall. If you watch a play in, from practice on film, does it take a lot longer to scout that than a game or than a game play in particular? It's it's it's, it, it's instant, and basically the more experience you have. I mean, it, it's uh, very, very fast. Um, now, earlier in a coach's career, you have to go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And as your knowledge base increases, it just speeds up.